This is Chris, the Idaho painter. In this video, I'm gonna give you four professional secrets to painting stucco, so stay tuned for this video. So here we go, the first secret, professional secret, to painting stucco is typically all the stucco we deal with is gonna have some type of crack, some type of hairline crack, or even cracks even bigger. And how do you go about dealing with that? So John is gonna show us one of the secrets to filling cracks in stucco. So John, why don't you show us what's going on here? Yeah, one of the things we do is we use a masonry caulking that's actually uh, texturized and then has a high elasticity so that it's not going to break apart and then it's not going to flash as much because it's already got some sand and grit worked into yeah. it. Yeah, so this, this masonry caulking, it's unlike a regular caulking that's just smooth, it's got sanded grit so it blends right in with the stucco. So we're going to take our caulking gun, we're going to work the, this masonry caulking right along that crack. And you don't want to put tons on, just enough to start filling that crack. We'll work our way all the way down here. And you can take your finger and you can lightly, very lightly smooth it out. Wipe the excess off. And then a little trick I like to do is I'll take a, an old duster brush that's a little bit wet. You got a little bucket of water here. Get some of the water off and we'll kind of work that caulking with that duster brush, jabbing into it with the bristles. And what that'll do is that's going to help feather out that caulking so that it doesn't show up as bad after we've painted it. You see there in the wet paint, it's almost all gone. We'll just kind of push it in a little bit. And that's it. Now we'll paint it and it shouldn't show up at all. So professional secret number two is painting with flat paint. So when we're painting stucco, we always want it to, when it dries, to look like true stucco. So we got a flat paint we're using here. I know a lot of painters will use a satin and when the satin dries, then it has a, a sheen to it. And then one of the things about flat paint also is that it touches up a lot easier. So when you go back, stucco is really difficult. You gotta spray it a lot of different angles and stuff like that. And if you miss anything, you can go back and spray it right in the middle, anywhere, at any angle, and it's not gonna show. Touch ups are really easy with flat paint on stucco so secret number two is using flat paint so professional tip number three is how to go about spraying your stucco and spraying stucco is a lot different than just spraying the siding on a house stucco has a lot of different angles basically just an infinite number of angles you can spray up down sideways upside down all these different angles so you want to kind of spray it in this random pattern so John's gonna show us how we go about spraying stucco we got some stucco right here so let's see how you do it John yeah first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over the whole thing uh, work my way across and then I'm gonna come back over it and have some randomized patterns to try to get as many of those angles and then hide any spray pattern that I've put up. So there you go, that's a little bit how you spray stucco and hide your spray pattern. When this dries, we're gonna get on a ladder and we'll look at it at different angles and see if there's any touch-ups or light spots. So there you go, secret number three. So here's professional tip number four when it comes to painting stucco. And this is painting corners. Corners are not easy to paint. And we're gonna show you how we go about painting corners so they look really natural. We're gonna be using a cardboard shield holder, the craft cardboard shield holder, and we're gonna be spraying it and we've got Typically when we're spraying stucco, we're gonna be using a 30 inch gun extension, a 515 tip, and we got our airless sprayer set at 2200 PSI. So here we go, John's gonna show us how he goes about spraying corners. Always wear a respirator. Because when you spray this corner, I would go back and forth like this. The problem with it is the insides uh, of, of these, all, all these little bits of stucco always get missed. Now if I just spray like this, I'm gonna lose a bunch of overspray off that way, and if it's cold or humid, it could carry a little way. So what we'll use instead is a cardboard shield holder to help block our overspray. And 
just like that, we finished off our corner and it looks great. No light spots, no missed spots. So there you have it, four professional secrets to painting stucco. Don't forget, if you haven't followed us on Instagram or Facebook, you can follow us on Instagram, Idaho Painters. Facebook is The Idaho Painter. Check out our website, theidahopainter.com. If you want to purchase any of the tools and accessories we use in our videos, we got our Amazon affiliate links right there on our website where you can help support our channel just by purchasing our tools. You can check out our live show. John and I are live every Monday on YouTube. Live Monday YouTube, 7 p.m. Mountain Time. So check out our live show. And don't forget to ring the little notification bell. That way you'll be notified whenever we go live. And if you've got any tips that we left out, anything that you like to do when you're spraying stucco, let us know in the comments below. We'd love to see those. Yep, leave your comments below. We'll see you on my next video. Out.